Welcome to Hana Talks Live TV. I'm Hana Gilman, your Relationship Mastery Mentor. Someone needs to say this, and how did I get here? I wasn't going to do a video today. Um, I have an appointment in a few minutes, and I was in my house. I posted another video on LinkedIn, and hi, Victoria, and I saw there another video of mine, and I decided to watch it. Now, that video was excellent. <laughs> it was from November uh, 17th of 2017. And it made me say, oh, go outside and talk to these people. These beautiful women need to be told this or asked this. This needs to be brought up again. So here's what I want to say. In that video on November 17th, I spoke to you about preparing for 2018 and making it a new year, not a year that you'll just redo 2017 again. Because the truth is, that's how so many, and I did for years, people live their life. They just keep doing the same old, same old, right? And it's not a new year, it's just another year of the same things. So in that video, I talked about preparing yourselves and not just waiting for your January resolutions. So here's what I want to ask you. I said in my video yesterday that we are in April, and that was November, so December, January, February, March. Five months later, how is it working out for you? Have you done anything differently this year? Those resolutions that you waited to make in January, are you still with them? How are they working out? Did you lose the 20 pounds? Have you lost 10 of it? Did you get the new job? Are you married yet? What is different for you in your life? One of the things that's majorly different for me is that this is my 155th plus 15, my 170, 70th video live on Facebook. Whoa, that's a celebration, right? I've kept going. I decided to make this year a different year about myself and for myself. So here's the thing that I want to say to you. What are you desiring? What did you want back then to be different? That sun is in my eyes. To be different for you in 2018. I want to marry a great guy. Have you become the great woman that that guy wants? Or are you still running the subconscious? All the people in Hebrew, I'm really sorry. I just can't take the time to read it. But I'm so happy you're here. Um... You really want to marry that great guy this year. Hi, Mati. And you, but you're still running the tapes of, I need to lose the 20 pounds. You know, it's, it's just, I'm not worthy of really the great guy that I dream I'm worthy of. You don't even know you're thinking these thoughts. Or are you just so tired of the fact that you're divorced or widowed or never married and all of your friends keep getting married. Why aren't you? You just seem to watch everybody living a life that you want to live, but it doesn't happen for you. Why not? So one of the main reasons is that you bring split energy or create chaotic vibration to your life, which is what I just gave you examples of. I want a really great man, successful, who will give me gifts and will travel. But on the inside, in your subconscious tapes, you're not worthy. You don't deserve. I want to tell you, I'm in another group and it is so phenomenal that one of the things I'm learning is in being vulnerable because that's where your feminine radiance is, beautiful women, on the other side of vulnerability. And what I've 
what we've been talking about in there is the real aspect of vulnerability for women is to admit your desires. Yes. What do you really want? What do you want? What do you dream about? Besides the great guy, maybe you want money. Do you admit that money matters to you? You want to play with money. You want to have fun with money. You want the things that money will bring to you. You want the great guy. Not for what he'll give to you, the truth be told. You want the great guy for that he'll enhance your life and you'll be able to be a bigger giver to him because his happiness will be your focus. Wow, what an interesting thought, Hana. I never went there. <laughs> anyway, how are your resolutions working out? Have you done anything different? I'm sure for 80 to 90% of you that watch my videos, you haven't and you don't and you aren't doing anything different. Why? Because unless something really matters to you, unless you have a tremendous desire or a compelling reason to get off the couch, you're not going to do it. And the truth is you can't do it alone. Why not? Because you haven't. You can't do it alone because you lose motivation. Your old tapes will kick in and bring you back. You need someone to pull you forward, to be not afraid of your fears because they're already where you are. You need me. Join my private Facebook group. Type into your search box on Facebook, Relationship Mastery with Confidence and Dignity, and I will let you approve you to join the group. That's, let me ask you that. Of one thing to do different this year, why do you keep watching the videos? And if you keep coming back for them, which I see many of you do, hi Tirza, as I see that many of you do, why are you not joining my private group? Are you afraid I'll call you out? Oh, that tells me you're a hider in all areas of your life because beautiful women, how you do anything is how you do everything. Do you hide? Do you watch from the background? Are you afraid I'll call you out? I don't call anyone out in the group. I really don't. It's just a safe space to come and we celebrate each other in there. And I do much deeper teaching. Please join. Do something different for yourself. It's free. Make that a simple investment for yourself. I've talked to you about split energies and chaotic vibration. God doesn't match our words. He matches our vibration. He's giving to us every single minute. If I'm in a worthy vibration, more positive comes in. If I'm in a negative, I don't deserve vibration, it's not going to happen. I will get more negative vibration. Do you understand that? I'm sorry for the noise, it, I just realized it. They're doing maintenance on the, pro, on the grounds. Um, you see the buildings in the background? Those are my bedrooms that I have in the mansion. No, I'm teasing. <laughs> Do you feel that vibration? I live in a gorgeous apartment complex, but I feel that I, they're all just part of my space. How do you feel about your space? If I can teach you anything, it's model my humor and model my desires and model my everything. But Hana, you don't have what you want. You don't have the husband. You're right. I used to not have him because I didn't think I deserved him. Today I don't have him because I'm the prize and I haven't met the winner of the prize yet. Do you hear the difference? Do you hear that vibrational difference? Do you hear the work that's been done to get you from here to there? Ladies, there can be no happy ending to a sad journey. If you keep being negative, if you keep playing the same thoughts, nothing ever is going to change other than those negativity and the same things the thoughts have brought you till now. 
wow, I wasn't going to do a video, but I feel so talkative with you today. I'm also sitting down, which is something I haven't done in a long time. Um, go for gold. Up-level yourself. Raise your bar. You know, a comfort zone is a beautiful place, but nothing ever grows there. Chew on that one. Join my group, Relationship Mastery with Confidence and Dignity. Become aware of your split energies, what you say you want and what you believe you deserve. Usually major gap. What you think you deserve, you're usually looking for problems to prove you right. Reasons to prove that you're right, which will keep you in your comfort zone. When you're on a higher vibrational level, you will then scan for opportunities and those will prove your worth because you will attract higher things to you. It sounds so simple. Anything easy is easy not to do also. You cannot do this alone. How do I know? Because you haven't. I couldn't do it alone. I, have, I bless my teachers and my coaches to this day and I still have them. Because you know what? When you get to a higher level, higher level, new devil. There's always going to be issues. Always. But those are the contrasts that you grow from. Because you remember I've said that for every contrast, everything that comes to your life that you don't want, you shoot a desire rocket for wanting better. Ugh, that was a lousy date. I can't wait to deep make and date a better guy. This job is just not for me. I would love this kind of a job. It doesn't matter what the negative is because it's forcing you through, contra uh, through contrast to want better, more, bigger, dream. Don't be afraid of the negative because it will force you into a positive contrasting desire. The, the thing that you have to learn is how to shift into that desire. I can help you. It's about a quality of life, beautiful women. It's about a quality of life, whether anything in your life changes or not. That's it. I think I've talked a lot today. Um, good stuff. I love you all. I love that you turn in, tune in. I appreciate you. Please join my group, Relationship Mastery with Conf Confidence and Dignity. I'm throwing that challenge out to you. Do something different this year. If it hasn't worked for you for now, we're, a quarter of the year is gone. Do something different. If you wanted anything to change, you have to change. I'm here for you. I love you. There's a lot of love here for all of you. I will see you soon. I'm Hannah Gilman, your Relationship Mastery Mentor. Bye, everybody.